This video clip will help you strengthen your math skill of subtracting fractions with unlike denominators. Using just a couple of construction paper, you can master this concept quickly. Let's begin. Let's subtract one fourth from one half. Let's use the red construction paper to represent the one half. Since we do not have the one fourth, I'm going to find the equivalent fraction for one half using two fourth. Now, if I look back into the problem, I need to remove one fourth from one half. So now it's easy to remove the one fourth, and my final answer is what's left in there, which is my one fourth. Focusing on the representational stage for subtracting our fractions with unlike denominators, let's begin with a fraction of one half, which is shown in the visual as colored by the red. We need to remove one fourth. As you can see, the denominators look different. So removing a one fourth, which is not existing over here, let's find an equivalent fraction for one half. So converting the one half to two fourth. Now you can see you have two fourth. So I can easy remove my one fourth from the visual. So in this case, two fourth minus my one fourth gives one fourth as an answer. One half minus one fourth is one fourth. Let's focus on subtracting three eighth from three fourth. To begin with, let's use the yellow construction paper to represent our three fourth. Now, as you can see, I need to remove 3 8 from 3 4. Since I don't have the 8 in here, I'm going to find equivalent fractions for my fourths. So 1 8 and 2 8 is equivalent to 1 4. Extending them, I'm going to replace my fourth with 8. Now you can see I need to remove 3 8 from 3 4. Remove 1 8, 2 8, and 3 8. As you can see, what is left will be my answer. 1 8, 2 8, 3 8 will be my answer. In the case of this fraction, let's begin with 3 4. 3 4. I need to remove 3 8. As you can see, I do not have 3 8. So I am going to convert the 3 4 into the 8. Converting the 3 4 into the 8 by finding an equivalent fraction gives me 6 8. Once I have the 6 8, now I can remove the 3 8. As you can see, 6 8 minus 3 8 gives you 3 8 for an answer. So basically, 3 4 minus 3 8 is equal to 3 8.